Oh man. No, we should have definitely opened that door. <laughs> hey, peel off a little bit of the Corvette so we can compare the dusty side to the non dusty side. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Got a little dirty. So, today we're going to be working on the side skirts. We should get those entirely done. It's really a pretty simple design. Um, I haven't welded here yet, so I hope that there's enough amps going to this garage to be able to use my welder. I'm gonna get Frank's bumper off of there, and that's really it. I already have the template out. It's really just uh, some cotton, and then uh, we can start welding. I don't know where we're gonna put this back here. And then maybe I can move this all the way forward or backwards. That way I have like somewhere to <laughs> work. And then I'm gonna open this up actually. Yeah, it's not that cold today, so we're good. by four foot piece of uh, cold rolled 22 gauge steel. Um, it's pretty much what I use for everything on that car and on that car as well. But um, you know, just try and keep it consistent. Uh, it looks kind of nasty and there's like, it's kind of weird. It's like super corroded on the edges here. So I'm gonna probably try and stay away from that. But I did have to bend this a little bit to get it in the minivan that I had to pick this up in because there's not really anywhere good to put this in the Jeep. I think I'm gonna build the frame first. So it's basically just gonna have the you know outside, sides, and then the inside. And then I'll basically put it on here, mark it out, put it out of this, tack weld it, and then we'll put it up there on the car. Then we'll tack weld it on there, and then that's probably just gonna be it. I don't think we're gonna do it any other way. Are you moving the battery, leaving it? We'll push his car back and then we can push this car out. Okay. Anyways, right, so we can move on to the Miata here. It's really simple. I'm just doing a, basically this. Let's say this is the sheet metal. Okay. And then just a frame of square tube around it. Oh, fair enough. So I mean like, I do have the design. Yeah, yeah so then you're good. to make it look nice. this to this, and I'll clamp this to this, and it should therefore keep it 
pretty intact. But um, I'm gonna grind all these edges down. That way I can actually weld them. And then I'll clamp them up. I'll probably set them on some cinder blocks that way it's off the ground. Set up the welder and we can start welding. I thought you were looking for the eclipse. Yeah, I'm looking for the eclipse. I was like, it's last Two week, bro. Late. It's last week. That's all right. Is this our friend? That's my uh, rivet nuts or nut nut certs for the uh, side skirts and all that. They finally came. Yeah. How's it going? one there's two that should be enough of a bunch of different sizes i didn't know what size i wanted so i just got a bunch and there should be plenty because i think there's 30 of every size so therefore i should have 60 whatever size i decide to use and i knew i i needed less than 30 to do the whole car i just figured in case they pull out or something i don't know and they're cheap they're like i don't even know that thing was like eight dollars each so i just got two because i'm not gonna bullshit I kind of forgot that was hot. God, that was fucking steaming. Yeah, I'm sure that felt really good. <laughs>
could do it, but yeah, that'd be cool. Alright, spill the other one. So I've got this one entirely done. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do the other one and then I'm gonna fill these ends in. I don't think I want them to be open. And then I'm gonna grind this down before I put the sheet metal on it and then also grind these edges down just so it's a little bit more flat. So I went ahead and filled all these holes and so now I'm just gonna grind it down on the edges and then just on the side that I'm gonna be laying the sheet metal on top of. I'm actually gonna grind down all the sides while I have this thing out, just because I'm gonna have to do that before I tack it. And, uh, and uh, yeah. Did you try putting the stuff on the inside? Yeah. Did it work? It did? Oh, perfect. Oh, no! Yeah, How did you get it out of there? Let's yeah, check it out. I'm gonna wash it too since it's dusty as fuck. Yeah, that's kind of my fault for leaning on it. Alright, yeah, sounds good. I'll be right back. Okay. Be back. I don't know, probably have What's the nearest gas station with like a vacuum? Ooh, with a vacuum? I don't know. The shell right there? The shell? Up here? I mean like car wash and vacuum. I don't know. I'm going fucking back to where I'm hired. Just go down by you. You should let me know. Where you're going? Cause I want food. You getting hungry? <laughs> yeah, well, you're I'm you're my ahead. Uber Eats. He's about to get a ticket. Did you guys have such high hopes, George? What's that? Did you guys have such high hopes, George? That's because I don't take stupid risks, Tyler. Right, sweetie? Right. Sure. Right. I don't expect to get tickets because I don't drive around it with no, no bumpers. No, but you did have one last time on your windshield. Courtney, come on, now, yeah, don't, okay. don't be putting me on blast like that. I don't like that. I've cut myself a few times. Don't cut yourself today, bro. I'll do my best. Actually, I'm not at work, so I don't have to fill out any type of accident report, so you can do whatever you want, honestly. Hopefully, this is it. Oh, Chris, you're looking like you're a little under the weather, bro. I feel like shit. Don't want to work on that shit. You look like shit, too. You're done or what, bro? No, I still have quite a bit to go. I gotta tack all that on there, probably trim some, and then 
tack it all up inside there or maybe it'd be well there however I'm gonna do it but yeah that's all pretty freaking simple though I'm just really hungry I wonder who that is. Sam. All right, so metal's all cut out. Uh, it does overlap a little bit, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna have it match up with two corners, which is the two most like the seam edges. And uh, that's gonna be obviously the front and the outside. And then once the outside's tacked up, um, I'll probably tack the inside or whatever, trim it, and then make sure it's still sturdy. And then we'll be finished. Just like that. Now I'm gonna go ahead and grind off the excess material That's on the back edge and then on the inside edge. Just, you can see that there is some overhang so it wasn't cut exactly perfect. Are they a little different than your expectations? No. When you go like that? They taste exactly the same. Friday to Tuesday? But. So we got both of these finished and ready to be welded up. I understand we discussed this for a long time that it's probably not the best way to fit it up, but it's basically the easiest and that's just what I'm gonna do. I don't really feel like building a bracket. Like the thing is if they're gonna bend up or anything, they're gonna bend up. I'm not really gonna be too worried about it. Uh, worst thing, I bend it down and it breaks and then I just re-weld it because it's all just bare metal anyway. So I'm gonna move it over so that way we can get to the other side easier and then we're gonna start tacking them up. Well, actually I have to grind it down first and then we can tack it up. Because uh, the car don't get driven enough anyways. So we're just gonna weld it for the fuck of the car so it looks nice 24 seven. So is this gonna be like a 27 point tank? <laughs> Bro, why is he talking smack? My car leaves the garage every once in a while.
So like I'm about to just bring my Miata over and then let's just cut it and make it look like yours. We'll just have two of them. Dude, that would be so sick. sick. Right. You're so considerate. You're so considerate for yourself, buddy. <laughs> Do you smell that like you No, not yet. No, the bath got later burned. Oh. Okay. Tyler, is this like going to be legit? Right. I don't know, it'll probably be legit. That's five things at once. You didn't even shave this tip. I know. I wanted it to be uh, extra pointy. I wanted it to be pointy. I might have fucked that up on the way. No, it's fine. Yo, no, hey. Good? Good. Yeah. Yeah. I really got some. 